Audio Assault is known for their saturation magic across their line of guitar amp sims and tone shaping plugins. Their ultimate bundle packages up an assortment of tools to amp up your guitars, get your drums popping, while adding clarity and punch to different aspects of your mix. If you are ready for an Audio Assault, then join me for the next episode of I Don't Have a Band, right now. Welcome to episode 12 of I Don't Have a Band. In this episode, we're going to check out the ultimate bundle from Audio Assault, a 10 plugin bundle with a number of tools for guitars, bass, drums, plus a series of tone shaping plugins like Transient Shapers, an EQ, and some saturation. The great team at Audio Assault wanted to know what I thought, so they sent me over a license to check them out. The full bundle includes four plugins from the Guitar Amplifier series, two Transient Shapers, a Drum Builder, an EQ, and two saturation slash tone shaping plugins. Okay, let's jump into the studio and see how they sound. Okay, let's get into this. So I've got a very simple session here. Uh, I've got some backing tracks on my YouTube channel uh, in different styles. This is a, a hard rock jam. The drums are all in one track. It's just uh, MIDI drums. Obviously, if we we're doing a full session, we'd have all the components of the drums broken out. But just for simplicity, we've got uh, all the drums on one track. Uh, bass guitar and we've got two guitar tracks. The guitars and bass were recorded direct through a preamp and just a touch of compression. I've got a little compression on the drum track and a little bit on the bass and just a really uh, little small chain here on my master bus. Really not much going on here. The guitars, no plugins at all, just a direct signal. Okay, let's jump into the session here. I'm just gonna get some basic levels. Okay, we just pushed the guitars left and right there. Really not much going on. So let's start with the drums and let's take a look at the Exciter plugin. So this is a multi-band saturation unit and you've got independent control of four different bands. You've got the bass, low mids, high mids, and treble. And they have a few different circuits built into each, uh, each band. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna turn on the plugin. I'm gonna start uh, playing with some faders and let's uh, see how it sounds. There are definitely clear differences with these saturation circuits. I just need to adjust the output of this plugin to match the dry signal so we can get a better comparison. All right, let's take a listen before. and after. Cool. All right, let's bring in the bass guitar. We'll take a listen to it on its own. All 
So I think we're going to add a little EQ. The FreeQ 305. This is an analog inspired EQ. I'll start off uh, with the defaults, some of the presets here, and uh, we'll work from there. Let's take a listen. So here's the bass uh, before. Okay, that sounds pretty cool. Uh, one other thing I think we should add here is I think it needs a little bit of punch. And there just happens to be a plugin called the Punch. So Audio Assault says this will add some impact and dimension. So let's see what that actually means. Certainly adding nice drive to the bass. So let's uh, let's listen to it with the drums. Definitely a lot more aggressive attack, and it's really cutting through. Okay, I'm kind of liking that, so let's leave that. All right, let's take a look at the guitars. So I've split the guitars left and right, so let's work on uh, the left guitar first. We'll just listen to it solo. Okay, for the guitars, I'm gonna try, let's take a look at the grind machine too. So the grind machine is an amp and cab simulator and you can mix and match. So let's take a look and see what it's got. Okay, now we'll look at the guitar on the right side here. Let's just solo it. So I think the flavor we need here is the dominator. So this is a full guitar rig simulator. You've got uh, all sorts of choices for your amplifier, cabinets, and you've got an array of uh, pedals that you can add. It looks like you can add uh, five pedals. So let's take a look at the different uh, presets. So let's listen to it in context with the other guitar.
Oh, this is cool. You've got a whole uh, choice of microphones and uh, you can adjust your cabinets here as well. Let's take it on the British here and we've got the Dynamic 57. I think we all know what that is. And we can actually color the guitar a bit with the same Freak Q305. Okay, now let's listen to it all together. All right, let me remind you where we all started. I'll just turn off all the audio salt plugins. And then I'll slowly start adding everything back in. After spending some time with these plugins, I can say the ultimate bundle from Audio Salt is a killer package, especially for guitar players looking to craft a really big sound. And those amp sims are starting to sound pretty real. I better not let my wife know how inexpensive they are because she just might not let me buy any new amps anymore. Anyways, I only touched on a couple of the plugins in the bundle. There's some other really great tools here, so be sure to check them out. And Audio Salt has a try before you buy policy, so there's really no risk in trying. For more information on the Ultimate Bundle and other great plugins, visit audio-assault.com. As always, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. And please like, subscribe, and ring that bell if you want to stay up to date. Remember, you don't need a band to rock and roll. There are a lot of great musical projects you can do by yourself right from your own home. Thanks for watching.